everyone so it's uh tuesday october 19 uh exactly one week after my second chemo so the i'm making this video is to like yeah it's the same thing uh, to actually tell you the side effects the cumulative side effects of my previous chemo and so then uh, like how, how it adds up uh, to subsequent chemo treatments so after this second chemo basically i felt the same effect as the first one just that the nauseous was still there uh, then that I, I had experience of it already uh, so so like i took uh, anti-nauseous uh, before i even felt nauseous so i coped pretty well with it other than that seems quite okay just that i had like body ache then uh the hand where where i get the chemo the the vein would hurt quite a bit but other than that is quite quite well lah. so it's been exactly one week i started feeling better actually after four or five days and then uh so yeah i think that's mainly about it i just had my evening walk slash stroll lah. i do it like every day even when i'm on chemo like to keep active like hopefully it helps a bit then uh yeah i basically merge this with the third chemo treatment like what i did previously then just to give you guys an update after four chemo sessions i'll be having a pet scan uh in like what what they call it they call it uh, interim pet scan to see uh how's the progress whether has the cancer go into remission uh, so if it's all good uh, i'll only need three cycles which means six rounds of chemo plus some radiation then i'll be done so yeah, that's about it. Bye bye. Oh yeah, just to add on a little from my previous video, my hair basically started like uh, dropping quite a bit. So like after the third treatment, like if it still drops a lot, then uh, most probably I'll like shave it off lah. No, I think even though it doesn't drop, I'll still shave it off. So yeah, and the uh, bump has gotten down quite a lot. I can finally feel my neck bone and all lah. So, seems quite positive for now. Hi everyone, so it's like uh, the 1st of November now. So, it's been, yeah, like one month already just since my chemo and so on. So, yeah, since the third chemo has been a week, uh, the side effects have been the same or so. Uh, nothing much changed, just that, uh, yeah, I, I forgot to mention, I can't remember whether they mentioned the side effects before, but, but then it's like, on the 6th or 7th day, I'll, you, I'll start like feeling nerve pain or bone pain in, in the hand that I'm receiving the chemo. Because like, uh, one of the drugs, Dacabazine, if I'm not wrong, the last one, uh, ABVD, the last drug, that one kind of like, burn your vein on the inside. So, the pain do, do comes in, but then, as, as I read online, the pain usually strikes about at day 2, day 3, but I don't know why. My side effects is like, uh, from day 7 onwards up to like, day 13 or day 4, day 12 or day 13. Right? Then, yeah, it subsides like, later on. But then there, there are also side effects whereby it lasts really long, like up to the next chemo or maybe even after the whole chemo ended and so on. Right? So it can be quite uh pain uh. and yeah i shaved off my hair because like it drops quite a bit uh not not much but then it's thinning then it's quite annoying like when you wake up or you brush your hair you can see like two or three uh strands of hair dropping everywhere so might as well just shave it off first then uh most probably shave it off another time after all my chemo ends so yeah I think that's all for my update this time. Then update, I uh, constantly update like one week after each chemo already after this. So my next chemo will be on the 9th of November, which is chemo number four. Then chemo number four will be on 9th of November, which is a Tuesday. Then the following week on the Monday, I'll have my interim PET scan to check if you know the cancer is in remission, which means it's gone. Then I'll have a discussion with another doctor which is the radiologist because my treatment plan will be three cycles of chemo then radiation later on so yeah the radiation will be with another oncologist uh, for, for this thing so basically I'm feeling quite okay la, now not much has changed I tried to like change my diet to eat better and so on so hopefully like it helps uh. that's all for now
Bye-bye.